So every week at the same time, on the same day, I went to the doctor to get my shot. And I had a nurse that I put, put the shot on my stomach and it didn't hurt at all. And that was followed by like um, having the total body composition on the scale. Um, I did this every month, like every week for a month, and then every month they would raise the amount of medicine or the Munjaro dosage. And so they raised it every month, and I did this for three months. Then on the fourth month, because on the third month I reached my weight goal, on the fourth month I just took the lower dosage just to get off the medicine as a recommendation from Dr. Matt from the third. So how I track my progress while I was taking the Munjaro shots is every week um, when I, get to, I went to the doctor to get my shot, they will give me this body composition report. So the report will have like how much body I weigh, um, also my body fat percentage, it will give me visceral fat, it will give me the total body water, the muscle mass, and also every like my torso or the weight on my leg, the weight on my arm, it will be very detailed and precise. So it kind of helped me to know the beginning and the end also, um, so that I can like have a better idea. This is the uh, body composition report that I got, my first one, when I started my Munjaro journey. And as you can tell here, my weight was 143 pounds and 0.8. So that's how I started. And my total body fat was 30%. My visceral fat was seven. Uh, the fat free mass was 69.99. My total body water was 49.4. Muscle mass was 29 pounds. In my torso, I have 26.6 pounds of body fat. In my left leg, 5.3. On the right leg was 5.3. On the left arm was 2.6. And on the right arm was like 2.6 as well. So this is the last body composition report that I got. Um, and I have currently at 123.6 pounds um, and I want to put the other one beside it, the first one I got to so I can compare and as you can tell like it's almost like um, 20 pounds that I have lost uh, I started with a total body fat of 30% and uh, now I am at 24.6 um, my visceral fat started at 7 and now it's at 5 what is amazing to me is that my muscle mass started at 29 pounds and now it's 28.1 so I think the eating all the protein and lifting weights have helped me a lot because I have lost a little bit less than a pound of muscle mass so I am super excited about that and of course the amount of weight on my torso versus um, like before it was 26.5 Six and now it's 18.7 so you can tell um, when I well my clothes feel way better so I am so so happy about um, the results. I want to talk about the symptoms that I have from the Mujaro shots. Um, a lot of people say that they are throwing up as soon as they get the shots. The nurse told me usually um, you can expect some nausea on the first few days or then when you have the shot it's like I think your body's getting used to it. Um, but I never had any nausea, I never had any, I never vomited. Um, I think it's because I started with a lower dosage. So my body was getting used to the medicine. So I never felt tired either. Um, so what other people say that they're just exhausted, I think it's because they are not eating right. Because of course the medicine, your stomach, your brain thinks that you're not hungry, so you don't want to eat. So, but because Dr. Matt from Gutierrez told me that I need to start eating a lot of protein. I was, every time that I had to eat, I would just eat chicken, I would eat like steak, I would eat good protein, like oatmeal with peanut butter and not too much of the protein powder, but I would put some protein powder on my like oatmeal, for example. So, but one of the big symptoms that I did have, that was an ugly one, <laughs> was constipation. I mean, I was constipated for almost, the, it was hard guys. I mean, that was ugly. Uh, 
maybe five days without going to the bathroom, I would feel like all of my lower stomach was like so hard from like crap. I got prune juice, um, I got um, Myrolax, I got chia seeds. So the days that I knew that I needed to go to the restroom because I couldn't take it no more, I would get like a glass of prune juice and I would put my relax on it like two tablespoons and then I would have applesauce and I would just... Ah, and then celery because celery also is pretty good fiber. So I would be chunking on celery, drinking prune juice and I swear like hours later I went to the bathroom. So if you ever had that symptom, I think that was what it helped me. I hope you liked the video. On the next episode, uh, we're going to be seeing how Munjaro can be used with a more holistic approach with the help of a doctor and his team of personal trainers, how they guided me through the exercises to make and all the uh, food that, I, that it was better for me to eat in order to don't lose muscle mass and just burn body fat while taking Munjaro and also what the next steps were and recommendations when I finish the Munjaro shots or injections. So I think you're really going to enjoy this video. If you have any questions or you would like to tell us about your weight loss journey, put them in the comments below.